Hi, welcome. I'm Dr. Carla Sadek, and you've tuned in to another episode of the wonderful world of cysts and lipomas. In this video, which is an educational video, we take you through a step-by-step -step guide on how to successfully remove epidermoid cysts. If you don't know already, I specialize in the removal of cysts and lipomas. And if you'd like any information on how you could seek treatment, then please reach out to us at lipomacyst.com, your one-stop shop for all your cyst and skin needs. Remember, if you haven't subscribed already, please hit that subscribe button. Put comments down below. I'd love to hear what you have to say, your opinion on the procedure, things you might have done. Yeah, yeah. And if you like the video, share it and enjoy. Okay, so first things first. No, 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 no. I'm just going to put the honest, uh, I'm just cleaning it first. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then we're going to put the anesthetic in. Okay, this part hurts a little bit, all right? There's a sting. Well done, well done. This is the worst part of it. This is the worst part, and it works really quickly. Okay. Well done, well done, well done. Look, we have to put one or two of these in. That's it. That's it, well done. There you go, there you go. So how long have you been doing it? Yeah, we can do Yeah. Oh, wow, wow. Yeah, yeah. Did, you, did you even feel that as much, did you? Right. I'm going to make sure I give you enough anaesthetic. It's very tender, very tender. Well done, well done. Oops, sorry. <laughs> okay, now what I'm going to do is put a drape on you. Okay. There we go. You okay under there? Yeah. Good luck. Do that to work for a few seconds. Okay, alright. Let me know if you feel any pain at all, yeah? So the first time that we've had a thunderstorm in a long time, isn't it? Yeah, I think it's the first time we've, we've filmed with a thunderstorm as well. Normally it's traffic and police sirens. Uh -huh. But today, I think it's because the, the, you know, they're upset about the football. <laughs> That's it, the gods are upset about oh, the football. Oh. Robbed. Yeah. <laughs> They've done so well. But. Yeah. It's not meant to be. Not meant to be. It's a strong team. Mm. How are you feeling? Any pain? Um, so far now. Wonderful, wonderful. So we're just cutting our way down. So you, you've seen some of the videos, haven't you? Yeah. And what did you think? You thought they were disgusting. Yeah. If, if you had to say, like a particular pastry. <laughs> These cysts. What? Which, which, which pastry? As, as the master chef, which pastry? Oh god, it's like a, it's like a profiterole. Like a a profiterole. Out. I love it. Prof you know what? This one actually looks like a profiterole that you squeeze out. Yeah. Are you okay? Yes. I'm just imagining a video. That's it. Yeah. I mean. Imagine a profiterole and we're squeezing the oh, caramel, we're just emptying the, um, emptying out the sack. I don't know how to fit with it. Looks like this. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> I just watched the video, okay? You watched the video, that's enough, that's enough. Yeah. Alright, let's, let's clean that off. Oh, a bit more thunder. Adds a bit of granitism to the night. Yeah, so I've just drained it so I don't have to make a big enough um, incision. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get that sack out. So, so let's have a look if there's got any more stuff in there. Yeah, you know, in position you have, you put the cream in like a, a white cloth and then you kind of squeeze it out. That's what, that's what it kind of looks like. You know, what's it called? What's that? What's, what's it called? Well, you know, when, what, what do you use to fill the profiteroles with cream? What's that instrument called? Oh, it depends. <laughs> it's pastry cream or... Pastry, you know you put it into like a white white cloth with a little nozzle? Yeah. What's that? What's that? What's that? A pattern bag. A pattern bag. 
piping bag. Piping, a piping. A cyst is like a piping bag. I kid you not. It's just like a piping bag. When you see this, you'll agree. Yeah, I'm, just kind of, I'm just gently dissecting the sack out now. It's very delicate, this sack. Anesthetic lasts about two to three hours. And then, if if you do have any discomfort, mm -hmm. you really shouldn't need anything more than a paracetamol or an ibuprofen. You won't need anything stronger like that than that. So the secret of these is really to just be patient and, and try and get the sack out intact. Because we want that 99% in incoming back ratio. Get rid of some of that connective tissue. Remember, if you're enjoying the video, we'd love to hear your comments. Put them down below, especially okay. if you're not subscribed. Don't worry, not subscribed. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Press the like. Remember, you can also catch us on Sunday. You the okay there? Yes. Further detail. Perfect. Just, just separating the sack now. Just del delicately trying to get to the, the base of it. Without rupturing it. Uh, ripping, I mean. And that there. You okay? Mm -hmm. Stretching a bit, yeah. yeah. Almost done, almost done. You can see the bottom of the sack. I'm just going to prize that out now, okay? And this gentleman has actually got the right thing. He's come to see us before he's got pain. So okay, so got a bit of There's a little that left. What's this in here? Okay. Take that out. You want to have a look inside as well and see what else is missing. Scar tissue, connective tissue. And that's the bottom of the, the cavity. It's <laughs> so actually on the hole there. There is nothing inside, so I'm happy with that. So, what I'm going to do is just close it up. It's going to look nice and pretty. Put that stuffy stitch underneath the skin. So what's your favourite um, patisserie? Croissant. Um, yeah. how, how do you how do you find like Paul's? Because they they have a nice patisserie as well. Paul's. 
Yeah. Yeah, it's a big two bugs. Yeah, it's a bit okay. Not the best for me. Not the best? No. You're the best. There are a bit of What about. Um, sorry, sorry, sorry. Is that, is, that, is that okay? What about Cafe Concerto? Oh, no, definitely not. Dreadful, aren't they? The cakes are weird. Yeah, definitely not. Yeah. That's the action. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. So I've got one more stitch to close this up. There we go. What about Leto? They make that Dolce Buffalo cake. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. So, with that finished, I hope you enjoyed it. Remember, if you're new to the channel, welcome on board. And I'll catch you all Sunday for the live chat. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.